Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV. Um, yeah, we are here in Yansha and down here at the harbor where we fought against Zenas and where is this uh, Namazu? Gyoen the Namazu. Considering this has a plus, this will lead to something, but I'm not certain what yet. It's it's not obviously apparent because this is not a plus or <laughs> we will see. You look not as one who hails from here. May I inquire, are you a traveler and a, are you a traveler? An adventurer? If so, where's the deed I would ask of you? Before we delve into details, introductions are in order. I'm Gyoin. Gyoin I am. I live in this shack with others like myself, and I, like many, have a dream. Yes, yes. I inspire I aspire to become a, the greatest of merchants, to be rich, to be wealthy, beyond compare. And then to have an apron made for me that is mine and mine alone. Yes, yes, that is my dream. Among the many treasures in our shack are a collection of emakimono that someone left behind. Beautiful pictures, wise words. One tells the ancient tales of a pure merchant who rose to great heights. Yes, yes. Ever since reading that, I have dreamed of doing the same. In the very tale, an able adventurer, much like yourself, appeared. Quite clever, quite knowing. He gifted the merchant his wisdom, his ways. And lo, here you are. It can be no more coincidence. It is fate. Destiny. You must forgive my manners. In my excitement, I neglected to ask your name. Your title. Might I have it? Serenia Shadowstar, is it? Then I shall call you Serenia. Yes, yes, that will do nicely. Now, where were we? Ah, of course. Uh, I was hoping to enlist your aid in my rise through the merchant ranks. I'm afraid I'm quite forgetful these days. I am, I am. My storehouse lot is not far from here. Would you do me, me the honor of paying a visit? I keep all my wares for them, my treasures, my trinkets. I should very much like to hear your honest appraisal. Yes, yes. Come in, Serenia. You need only follow me. This way, this way. There are a ton of crafts, quests here. I'll be right back with it. You need only wait a moment. Here we are. My pride, my passion. This is a collection of everything I've come together to, to own. It's quite remarkable, is it not? Amazing. Astounding. Here, we have grilled mayflies. Oh, and here's some desiccated toad. And this lovely vase here simply begs to have things placed within it, does it not? Yes, yes, it does. Well, what do you think? Come now, be honest, be true. What do your eyes see that will fetch a fair price at market, hmm? Mm. None. There's nothing here with part with a single gill for. Are you sure? But I spent days, years collecting it all. Surely there must be something of value, of worth. I just, I don't, I can't. Nevertheless, a dream is a dream, and I shall not relent. No, no. I find another path of greatness, another way to attain what people desire. For I'm destined to be a merchant of renown. Yes, yes. Now, bearing all that in mind, whatever shall I do? <laughs> yes, yes, I do believe an idea has come to me. Fish. People eat fish and those that it stands to reason. They must buy them, purchase them. I will take the fishing to provision my own supply, my own stock. I will bring my catch to you, Serenia, and with your adventuring wisdom, you can tell me which fish will sell and which will not. Your kind and mine have very different tastes, different lights. Yes, yes, we do. It will fall to you to enlighten me as to which fish agree with a palate of man. Until then, I shall await you by the water. Red chocolate, huh? Oh, ow. Ow, ow, that, that hurt. Oh, 
this will not serve. It will not serve at all, no, no. I set out to fish just as we had spoken about when we last we met, but I'm ashamed to admit I slipped on some wet stone and my what? My pole, it. I dropped it, lost it. Yes, yes, it's gone. Before you ask, no, no, I could not retrieve it. I'm an Amazon of a city, not of a wild. To cast myself into a running river is tantamount to taking my own life. Will you help me in this, Serenia? Will you find my rod and retrieve it? Return it? It's very dear to me, and yes, yes, it is. Please, I beg this of you. I know not where else to turn. <sighs> Let's see. Dive. My precious pole, my irreplaceable what? I'm but half a man without it. You are a fish. It shouldn't be a problem to dive. My what? You found it! As I knew that you would. I owe you a debt of gratitude. Oh, thanks. Yes, yes, I do. Yet, I confess, I admit I've been thinking on things since I lost it. Yes, yes, much thinking. It occurred to me all the Namazu I know are fishmongers. They are, they are, each and every one. That fact led me to recall another passage I read among my Emma Kimono. It said for one to make a merchantile mark, one must offer something no other merchant does. A new product, a new service. And so I've made up my mind. I have, I have. I will look for another way to make my fortune. I've given it much thought, but there is much more to give. I will turn to my shack and dwell on this some more. Well, yeah, to become a great merchant, but before you s seek for something entirely new, uh, you could also get a bit of experience with something a bit more normal here in Serenia. You may be happy to hear, joyous to hear. I put have put faith in my marking mono. Their wisdom, their insight, they have led me to a new calling, yes, yes. I've learned there there's a pretty price to be paid for certain ores, certain minerals, and so I shall become a miner, a prospector. I fear I might inconvenience you again in this endeavor, as I did in the last, the, previ the previous. I only hope you're willing to lend me your wisdom again, yes, yes. I'm ready to begin my life as a miner, a prospector, yes, yes, I mean to search for my fortune, my fame, I'm sure it lies to the west of our manor. I will go ahead of you, Serenia, but please do come and find me, yes, yes. Fine. Where to look, where to look. Serenia, you gave me a start, a fright, but I'm glad to see you. It was so good of you to come, to visit. I'm prospecting for us as we speak, using my fortune-seeking barbels. Yes, yes, the Namazu barbel is a sensitive thing. Mine will detect where the most precious of ores lie. I do believe I found something. I feel a tingle, a twinge in my barbels. They tell me there's great mineral wealth to the north. I must go. Must away. The fate. Okay, Giren. It's all well and good to have found a choice of mining, a choice mining location, but I'm afraid my hands are stayed. There's a host of nasty beasts lingering, prowling. I can't get to be awe for fear of my life. Please, Serenia, you must help me. <sighs> okay. Sego and do I get paid for this? I mean, if you have, if you need me so desperately, you can pay me for it, right? It's 
kind of what one does with adventurer for their services. Ah, fail. Evil of monstrosities would pose no match for you. He says no match at all. The way is now clear. Leave the rest to me. I will mine these lands and amass a hall of ore the likes of which Dansha has never seen. But it will require some time, some patience. Yes, yes. You should return to my warehouse and await me, Serenia. I will not bore you with my digging, my picking. You know, buddy, I could advise you there too. I am a miner. So, how'd it go? The deed is done. Finished, yes, yes. And what a haul we have. Come, Serenia, and behold the fruits of my labor. Look at how they sparkle, how they shine. I have no doubt these ores will see me to greatness, to fame. I must show them to Gyofu. Yes, yes. He is very knowledgeable about the selling of ores. His appraisal will be most reassuring. Your fool, I have something for you to inspect to see. You cert you certainly are in good spirits. What is it, Gyoin? I have been mining and brought my first haul of findings for your appraisal, your valuation. Tell me how much gill will these ores fetch on at market? Is that what you've been off to all this time? Well then let us have a look, shall we? Yes, yes. Do you want the truth of me? Yes, Gyoin. And nothing besides. Yes, yes. Tell me your honest opinion. It is difficult to place a value on these ores you have. Quite difficult indeed. And that is because we are so very, very... Worthless. We direct a veritable pile of garbage across the young and into our manor. W worthless? But my barbels tingle, twinked. I would have staked my life at these ores were valuable. But thank the gods I did not. I suppose I must find another way, another means to make my fortune. Thank you, Gyofu. I do appreciate your honesty, your candor. Yes, yes. Kirin seems to be quite down. I hate to be one to tell them, but someone had to. We swaps he had were worthless. I used my barbell to detect the ore, just like my master taught me. Yes, yes, I did. Yeah, I suppose the barbells in my line are not fit for mining. Still, my dream is my dream. I will not give up yet. I will find another path to greatness, and when I do, you will be the first to know. To hear, Serenia. I failed at prospecting, at mining. I was so, sh so sure I would succeed. Never have been. Be Never have I been so disappointed with myself. But still, I will not give up now. If I do, I will never be rich, wealthy. Indeed, I have already thought of another way to make my fortune. Yes, yes. I taught once more to my Emakimono for wisdom, where I found a tale of a merchant who sold the wings and scales of monsters, of beasts. 
It will be my next endeavor, and I know this time it will work. Just imagine myself trapping just imagining myself trapping bees and collecting my parts make my barbels tingle, twinch. But I am just a Namazu. I have no hope of hunting these monsters and slaying them in battle. I will have to trap them and snare them, and I would like you your help in procuring the bait I require for my traps. There are beasts known as water serpents that sliver throughout the glittering basin. If you'd be so good as to fell three of them, I would have enough meat to set all the traps I need. Yes, yes. And once more the idea, um, an idea that entirely be depends on my help. You went, you suck at this. Okay, Gyoin. Your meat. How goes the hunt? Were you able to obtain the fresh water serpent flesh as I asked? Yes, yes, this is precisely what I need. And for my part, I've already finished constructing my traps. All that is left is to venture into the wild and set them. I do not wish to bore you with such a show. Await me here and I shall return shortly. Yes, yes. Going, I'm bored waiting for you. Taking far too long. Perhaps something has happened. Of course, something has happened. Are you alive? But thank you, my friend. You saved me yet again. I was out simply setting my traps and then I, I suppose I got a bit too excited and stepped into one of them. How embarrassing. How shameful. I'm finding that an effective trap is truly a dangerous thing. Yes, yes. I do believe I must abandon this trapping endeavor. I put faith in my, in my kimono and tried several ways to make my fortune, my fame. Yet none of them have gone well. None at all. I must return home and speak with Gyofu. He's very smart, very clever. But perhaps he has some idea as to what path I might tread. My failures are coming in quick succession, but I will not give up and I hope you will not give up on me, Serenia. For now, I shall return to my warehouse. Yes, yes. Still wondering what the unlock that is happening here is going to be. Beast trap? Namazu maybe? My wounds have been sent seen to tended to. I was told they're not grievous. I owe that blessing to you, Serenia. Had you not found me as quickly as you did, I fear the worst may have happened. Yeah, for the armor. For the armor. This was just the stats I would say, don't bother, but... The armor. I've got a new idea, Serenia. I leave the ideas to Gyofu. That's my idea. Yes, yes, please come with me. Let us hear what wisdom Gyofu has to offer. Kyofu, Kyofu, I have something to ask of you. 
I want you to tell me all you know. That much I can do? What is it, Gyoin? You're not looking your normal tripper self. I've been reading my Emakimono. They tell of so many ways to make one's fortune. I tried them all. Each one. Everyone. But I've yet to meet with any success. And so I want to ask you, Gyofu. If you were in my barbels, what would you do? Do you know of any path I can walk to quick wealth? Any at all? There is no path to quick wealth. Unless you count gambling. Just to put it out here. A quick path to wealth. Hmm. I suppose there's one thought that comes to mind, but it's dangerous. Very dangerous indeed. Do you know of the ruins that lie to the east of here? They were once a guardian stronghold. Within them, there still remain a manner of all manner of weapons, relics from the days of war. At least that's what the rumors say. Yes, yes. <laughs> there just might be some treasure there. Weapons so fine that would put even the smiths of Doma to shame. Maybe, maybe not. I cannot say for sure. But what I can say for sure is this. Those ruins and the way to them are fraught with peril. Looping taunt looters prowl the place. Monstrous hounds called Taokwan lurk in the shadows. There's no wealth to be had in death, Gyoin. No, no. You should not go to this place. Treasures. Relics. It is more than I hoped. Thank you, Gyofu. I knew I was right to ask you. It would not be a quick path to wealth if we are not dangerous along the way. That too was written in my Imakimono. I will go to these ruins and will find my fortune. Still, I do not stand much of a chance against Lupin and Taokwan or and whatever other dangers may come. Hmm. Of course, you come with me, won't you, Serenia? I knew what you would. Yes, yes, come in. Let us away. You're not becoming my agent, Gyoin. And these are my successes you want to sell. I have no idea how I made it this far without being seen. Not spotted, not smelt. Maybe I have a talent for going undetected. I wonder if that is a skill I can use to get rich. Thievery? I will think more on it later. For now, let us keep the pace. I will make it all the way to the Guardian Ruins without a soul other than you and I knowing of it. Yes, yes. I made it without a single beast or fiend taking notice of me. All too easy, but now for the hard part. To find whatever treasures await. By the way, I did see a horde of some rather mean looking looping just over there. Very nasty, very feral. So here's my plan. While I search these containers for anything worth selling, you create a diversion and lure the looping away from me. Yes, yes, you're an adventurer. Surely you live for quests such as this. Okay. I don't know. Okay, Gyurin. Found anything? A perfect diversion. Thank you, Zerenia. I could hear the din of battle while I searched. I wanted desperately to come and help you, but I managed to stay true to my task. And lo, I found some relics that look quite valuable to my eye. I will head back to the manor and show them to Gyofu. You will know if there is anything here worth selling. And I have a feeling that this time there is. Must be. Has to be. Look, Gyofu, I've returned from the Guardian Ruins and here's my haul. What do you think? Do you see anything here that will fetch a fair price at the market? You truly went to the ruins? And returned to speak of it? You are braver numbers than most, Gyorin. Courageous, bold, come in. Show me what you have. Hmm, this piece is very fine indeed. And this one as well, a truly fortuitous find. 
Well done, Kieran. Every weapon here looks to be valuable. We need a bit of touching up here and there, but yes, yes, we will fetch you a good deal of coin. There are many Dobermans who still wish to fight the Guardians to the last. We will be more than willing to take these weapons off your hands and part with a pretty guild to do so. Do you think so? Truly? I finally found something worth selling? Worth peddling? Worth vending? Have you ever known Gyofu to give a false appraisal? No. No? Your dream is at hand, Gyoen. Sell these weapons, take the coin you make, and with it you can start down the path to becoming a legendary merchant. I will. I will. Starting this day, I'm going to open my own shop. I will name it The New Witch. Customers will flock to my doors from all over Yangsha. Yes, yes. My business will thrive and my coffers will overflow. And my barbels will guide me to greatness. Thank you for all your help, Serenium. You have been with me through it all. I will not forget you when I am at the top. Okay, but that seems to be it for now, because the next one is Yoshu here. Let's see. Hmm. But here it doesn't have a... So this is really a single quest. Okay, let's just quickly do him as well. Are you an adventurer in need of a job? If so, I have a small one for you. Yes, yes. There's a man in Namai by the name of Yamakage, and I wish for you to find him and pass along this message. I have your daughter. Uh, what? This is most likely a misunderstanding here, but <laughs> yeah. What? My daughter? Yoshu said that? Are you sure? I always thought him to be a good Namazu. Kind and jovial. I I named him among my friends. Never would I have thought him capable of kidnapping a child. Tell me, what are his demands? Hmm? All the gill that I have? If it is coin he seeks, there's not much I'm able to master. Please, take him a message from me in, retu in turn. If a Namazu sees fit to ask these jobs of you, they must trust you some measure. Tell him that I need time. If he grants me just some sons more, I will gather what coin I can. Will you tell Yoshu that? Please, the life of my daughter hangs in the balance. Time to gather more coin? I don't even... Whatever are you talking about? My apologies, it seems that my explanation was lacking. You see, I was out fishing with some friends earlier, and a young girl in tears floated up upon us in a small vessel. We asked her name, and she told us she was a daughter of Yamakage. Yes, yes, and so we fought. We brought her in and sent word to her father. She's off playing with our younglings as we speak, and very much enjoying herself. Quite happy, quite joyous. I'm sorry for the troll, but would you speak with Yamakage once more? Tell him all I have told you, and that his daughter merely waits here for him until he arrives. Yeah, <laughs> as I said, a misunderstanding due to... Um, shortening too much, I guess. What did Gyosho say? Will he give me the time I need? Will he spare my little girl? Not kidnapped? She was adrift and he saved her? But he did he not say so in the first place? I've been worried six that I may never but I may never see my daughter again. But fool's messages are always wanting for words. As from time to time he comes from Namai to paddle his wares. He has always taken the time to play with our children. And for it our children have always taken a liking to him. I'm ashamed to have doubted him. 
and to have thought him capable of such a horror, I will go claim my daughter and to offer my apologies. Mayhap I would take him some fine tea to drown this misunderstanding. Forgive us, give us both for getting you mixed up in this. Thank you nonetheless. There's still nothing unlocked. Guess this is part of a greater something? Anyway, I end this here, I think. Until next time when we play more Final Fantasy XIV, I'm Mace and don't get lost.